hey guys welcome back to sussex squad forever i hope you're all having an amazing day and guys carl larson has set the record straight i'm going to read you guys an article titled don't believe the rumors prince harry and Meghan markle's marriage is doing just fine so don't believe the hype despite ongoing and persistent divorce rumors prince harry and Meghan markle's marriage is doing just fine thank you very much amidst failing rumors ok reports that the pair are are happy together as they continue to build their lives in montecito california with children prince archie and princess lilibet family friend carl larson said of the sussexes please do not believe the media harry and megan are very much in love and are happy together nothing but smiles and laughter here this counters reports from the likes of british aristocrat lady c who previously told okay i have heard from five totally reliable sources that harry called in the lawyers some months ago she said presumably referring to divorce lawyers the so the problem is that the information doesn't necessarily match up with their public face but of course the public face is to an extent slapped on for monetary gain so we've seen harry and megan just a few days ago holding hands laughing while they were out in santa barbara you know doing their own thing so lady c is just looking to make a quick buck that old woman is just trying to get retirement money and she's telling all these lies five reliable sources who are those sources carl larson who is a family friend who is very close to the sussexes has set the record straight do not believe this lying tabloids so royal expert angela levine who is generally a pretty vociferous critic of the sussexes added i think if you have a row in your marriage you perhaps might go into another room if you book a room permanently that means you are going to use it a lot so he's not in the family house anymore wow like she's out there looking at harry and megan 24 7 who hired stoker plus these people are just writing all this false information for clickbait in order to get money but i'm happy that carl larson has set the record straight and has told the entire world that the sussex's marriage is great they are more in love than ever and if you actually look at the people who are writing all this all these women reporting this jealous women jealous women who have nothing to show for their lives or their careers another one is megan's half sister samantha Markle, who also added fuel to the divorce rumors saying i see it ending in divorce unless they get extensive counseling and can agree to work on being honest to work on apologies to everyone that they've damaged in the course of this bull in a china shop two years spill this coming from a woman whose daughter preferred megan markle at her wedding instead of her own mother wow 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 like she has any basis to say anything her daughter invited megan markle to her wedding and didn't invite this samantha bully because she knows her mother is just another lying and money hungry you know tabloid so the press treatment has always been rough for the sussexes but especially so in recent months despite this a source close to the couple claims the pair are unfazed by critics and said people can call them money hungry and even grifters but harry and megan think it's jo it's all just jealousy and mean, mean people flinging stones of course of course honestly it is just clear that the tabloids are upset especially the british royal family they're upset that harry and megan are doing well without the titles without needing anything from the royal family and this is what's getting them mad that after everything they throw at harry and megan they still stand back they still come back better every time and this is really pissing them off that's why they are writing all this nonsense for clickbait and to make money so the two seem happy with their new life in the u.s where they relocated in 2020 after their step back as working members of the royal family in january so harry and megan 
left the UK for the very many reasons that we know of the terror you know the threats to Megan's life all these terrorists who we can see to have been convicted and Harry just wanted his family to be safe to be peaceful to be happy and that is why he went to the US he said that the thing his family wanted was to bully Megan into leaving but what they didn't count on was the fact that he would leave with her So Harry has decided to leave the UK life behind and start a new life because honestly he says he is happier away from all that toxicity and he's been he's never been happier than he is when he is with Megan and their two children. So this week Harry was spotted with Lilibeth who just turned to at a 4th of July parade complete with vintage vehicles decorated with american flags passing through the streets so though only harry and lily were pictured megan and archie were also said to be in attendance too and that is what the story this tabloids were trying to run they did not want to show megan and archie so that they can run with all this their false narratives but guys there is a clue showing harry Megan and their two children together at the parade. Of course the tabloids will not show that because they want people to believe all these false narratives that they're running about their marriage. So um guys the next day Harry's father King Charles took part in his second coronation ceremony which was a major flop because he was being booed left right and center. So guys Larson has set the record straight to all these haters, to all these bullies. The Sussexes marriage is okay. It's doing great. They are in love and they are happy. So for all these people running all these divorce rumors, uh, Lady C saying five reliable sources, who are those sources? We want to know. Clearly those sources are just made up in her mind so that she can spread all this lies and rumors about the Sussexes and it's really really disgusting because when these people where do they get off writing all this nonsense about the Sussexes it's really really disheartening to see that people would hate on someone just because of the color of their skin just for choosing to live their lives but guess what? All of these things will not phase Harry and Meghan. Clearly, Larson has said they're unfazed. And they know it's just jealous people flinging stones. And guys, if the tabloids think them writing all this nonsense is going to make Harry and Meghan's marriage any less strong, then they're wrong. In fact, they're just strengthening their love because they will fight all of this together. And... The tabloids can write whatever they want to because they are hiding the fact that the marriage that is actually falling apart is Catherine and William. So we know the truth. We know the truth. The tabloids are just trying to blind us by writing all these fake reports on Harry and Meghan's marriage. But we know which marriage is falling apart exactly. We have seen the proof. So guys, let us continue to show our love and support for the Sussexes. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. Bye.